hi everyone welcome to my channel and uh, today I want to show you guys this cool trick that I just discovered um, so I have this hair dryer it's got the soft touch feature which is like a you know a, what do you call it a rubberized matte finish and I've had this dryer for quite a few years and over time it's just gotten like super duper sticky and just really gross. I can't even use this hair dryer to be honest. I, I I was debating on buying a new one until I saw this trick. Until I saw this trick, um, and I was like, okay, well, let me try this out. See if it happens. See if it works. Okay, and it does work. It seems to work pretty well. I tried it out on the back side. Excuse me. On the back side of the dryer, right here. So you can see it's like just really gross and sticky here. No. Here, it's nice and smooth. Look at that. Yeah, it looks really nice. Um, so what I'm going to do, turn it around, okay? And I'm gonna clean this with acetone. There you go, acetone. Um, so basically nail polish remover, all right? And a lot of us usually have that at home. So let me just take some on a little and I'm just gonna start cleaning the handle. Just and look at that. Ah, yes, nice and clean already. It just it, wow. It just it just seems to just come right off. That um, takes takes that ickiness and the stickiness from that finish right off. The finish over time, I guess it degrades, and then you. This is what you end up with. It's it just screws stickiness. Um, so yeah, let me show you guys. This acetone stuff stuff really works, and it's I mean you know acetone's cheap if you um, and so are cotton swabs and or cotton cotton rounds. And if you, you probably have all of both of those in your house. Um, so yeah, yeah, check that out. Look at that. Oh, nice and clean, not sticky anymore. Oh, I can actually use my hair dryer now. So exciting. Uh, especially with winter coming up. I, I usually let my hair air dry, but in winter time I do like to just give it a little blast because it does, it is cold you now. So yeah. Well, there you go. You can see. Look at that. Nice and clean. Shiny. Alright guys, I wanted to show you guys the finished hair dryer. I went and cleaned all of it with acetone. See the I I literally some of it um, I literally rubbed the finish off. The there was still some left, you know, just gotta dip in and go back over it with a lot of acetone. Also make sure you're doing this in a well ventilated oh man, I missed a spot. Make sure you're doing this in a well ventilated area. because um, acetone can get pretty smelly. Um and but yeah so try it out let me know what you think um i also read that alcohol can do the same thing too but i didn't have any rubbing alcohol at home i only had acetone so or you know nail polish remover so yeah just try it out let me see let me know if this trick works out for you if you've got something of this nature um where the you know the finish has gotten it has degraded and you know gotten sticky so let me know if this works out for you I'm excited to share this. Um, oh, if you like this video, thanks for watching, uh, and please like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye bye.